<laughs> Welcome to Schmooze. And tonight we're talking with Chiquinta Jones, who has developed a new partnership with Nicole Kahn. So uh, welcome. It's nice to have you here at Schmooze. Thank you. So let's just go ahead and jump into it. I uh, hear you have a new partnership with Nicole. Uh, can you explain that a little bit? Yeah, I guess last year I got in contact with Nicole about my concerns for ongoing funding for the films that she was producing. Um, and I decided to make an offer of leaving some of my estate to set up the foundation so that it would be ongoing funds. It's a platform as well for people who do not donate regularly um, and also for anybody that wants to put some regular funds aside. That's certainly a very generous gift. What was the impetus behind um, your decision to make this donation? I, in the early 1990s, I um, lost my partner to breast cancer and I was looking for a way to reconnect with my community and um, I started watching some films, um, looking for some inspiration, uh, came across Clear of the Moon and that just started that lovely um, walk back to humanity, you might say. I just felt that I'd lost passion and watching some of Nicole's films brought that back and I wanted to make sure that I could contribute some way in making sure that happened on a continuous basis and not just intermittently. Nicole's films have certainly touched all of us at, at one point, and they're very personal. So what do you hope Nicole will uh, accomplish with this, this legacy fund? What I'm hoping is that it um, establishes, first of all, a good base of ongoing funds, and secondly, it allows Nicole to um, make a movement towards more mainstream audience. I think her work needs to be appreciated and seen by a lot more um, people than it does at the moment. But one of the best things about Nicole's films is storytelling. And if you get that right, that's one of the reasons people will keep watching the films. It's not just a one-off case. They go back and re-watch the films to find those lovely details and nuances that she puts in as a writer, producer so, and director. So I'm really pleased to be part of this because I think it sets up a movement forward. No, I certainly agree. You know, I've heard that, that your generosity will allow Nicole to move in more of this mainstream direction. And, you know, moving out of your comfort zone is always something that's just a little bit scary. So being a business partner and uh, kind of going in this direction is one thing, but as such a fan of her films, what do you think about this mainstream direction? Look, I really believe that it's the good storytelling and, and they can be anybody's stories. I I think that it's time to move forward and start breaking down any sort of barriers that have been there in the past. Um, and I just believe Nicole um, puts a lot of herself into her films. She's very brave in doing that. And I think that's the direction that it should take. Now, I think we've all encouraged um, Nicole to, to use her talents and not worry about it and just move forward without having to label herself or niche herself and uh, just be brave. So we'll, we'll see. Uh, I'm, I applaud you and your efforts here. It was wonderful talking with you. I know Nicole is uh, very excited about beginning this project. I hear Nesting Doll is, is certainly uh, well in its way. So is there something you can add about the new production of Nesting Doll? Um, I'm really excited by this. I think it's probably the closest to Nicole's heart type of film that she's um, putting together. And I think we're just going to see in leaps and bounds those um, nuances and details just explode on the screen. I'm really excited about it. Um, I got in touch with Nicole again very early in the piece when she was first talking about doing this film. I'm really pleased that she's moving forward. Um, and I think this is just going to be another wonderful film and I hope accepted in a more wide base. The movement forward is to do mainstream, I'm sure about that. Oh, well, yeah, I certainly agree and I hear there's a little political intrigue in this one, so that certainly catches my attention. So, uh, Chikenda, thank you so much for joining us this evening and we look forward to talking to you again about some of the other projects that Nicole will be working on. Wonderful. It's been lovely to talk to you, Mary. Thanks for the opportunity. Absolutely. My pleasure.